Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing an old art sketchbook tour. This is one of my old um, art notebooks. I actually recently purchased two of these agendas so I can um, store some of my old art in them. So I have looked through a few of these things before. Um, and I, most of the stuff is from two to three years ago, so it's just letting you guys know that this is not how my art looks currently. I will show you guys the current drawing just so you know how my art looks now. You can also go on my Pinterest to see how my art looks. Um, yeah, so this is something my brother made. But anyways, this is how my art looks now. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get started with the old sketchbook tour. The first thing I have in here is this um, like pig character from a movie. I think that's not really from that long ago. I just didn't really do a good job on it, and my friend wrote that. In fifth grade, we had to make these little stamps, and I chose to make this character here. Um, we kind of like carved a piece of rubber. It was like a whole like project, and this is what I decided to make, and that's how the stamp turned out. I think it's kind of cute. Um, I followed a lot of art tutorials, so this is from the channel. They're all so cute. some slime logos because for a while I was really into slime. So there's that one, that one, and that one. I actually used to have a slime shop. It is still running. However, I have it set permanently on vacation mode. That way I don't really have to deal with it. Um, but I did make a slime shop for a while along with one of my friends. I just, yeah, if you go to my first video, you can see it. I don't know where that logo is for it though. I'll have to find that. That would be really interesting to show you guys. Maybe a redraw that would be really cool. Um, this is like a little squirrel human. I never really was into a huge like anime phase. Um, I do have some kind of similar drawings to anime, like this one here. But I think the reason I never really got into like an anime phase, a lot of people like talk about what happened in their art journey because I wasn't really exposed to anime. Um, I didn't really watch it when I was younger. I watched more cartoons, so um, there's definitely a lot of art or more cartoony art later on in some of these, um, as you can see here. But yeah, um, I followed a lot of chibi like fun to draw tutorials as well. I think chibi is the closest I got to anime. Um, like I knew what anime was, however, I didn't really watch it. I still don't really watch anime, but I still appreciate the art style. Um, these were little characters I designed for like a fashion catalog I was drawing. I just think it's really fun to design clothes. So I was doing like one for like kids clothes and I don't know if it's in here but I do have like a like in style magazine knockoff which I was really proud of for a long time um but yeah here's like a, another like magazine I guess that's like teen clothes um here I have some uh like drawing templates for some pins I was designing. I These are actually current because I had just made the pins, so I'll actually show you guys them. So here's this one, that one, that one, and then this one still has the um, actual like pin backing on it. The um, pins for the rest of them fell off, or I took them off because they were falling off. I didn't want to lose them. Um, so those are those. <laughs> I do have another one, I just don't know where the template is. I think it's later on in here. I do have a redraw of this on my Instagram if you want to see that. But I I have not done a recent redraw of it, so maybe um, that's what I should do because this one would be fun to redraw since it is in full color and the character design is kind of cool too. when I got into my like cartoon phase I drew a lot of um like cartoony looking characters um, I also guess I drew some like of my stuffed animals these are just those like beanie boo stuffed animals I 
do actually like this drawing, so maybe that's a possible redraw. Um, I guess this is what I called anime back then because that's what the page is titled. <laughs> I was doing these out of my head without reference, but I do think this is actually fan art for a show. Um, but these are drawings without reference, and I did this character in a different style just because I thought it looked cool. Then I did this character completely like different from how the actual character looks just because I didn't really want to draw her design. <laughs> Yeah, so kind of interesting. Some of these are in shape protectors because they were originally in another folder and I've just taken them out and moved them to another one. Um, remember I had this kind of like notebook thing, so there were some drawings that were from that. That's kind of cute. I think I was trying to shade hair in this drawing, but it obviously didn't turn out too well. the same character in a bunch of different styles so you might see some of those later on i don't know if they're in the next next notebook or not um this is really old i think this is when this american girl doll came out because i do have the dolls still um so yeah whenever that american girl doll came out that's probably when that's from um more doodles It was like a style challenge I did. Um, this was kind of before I knew how to do the style challenge, so instead of doing styles from different TV shows or different artists, I did more like kind of styles I created like chibi and my own style, my version of kawaii, cartoon, you know, that type of thing. Um, so just a bunch of random styles. However, I think this is really cool. Um, yeah, I think that's 11 from Stranger Things. Here's when I got into fashion designing, so there's a few of those in there. Again, um, fashion designing, that was a little catalog design I was doing. And here was like one of the orders from the catalog. I, I think it's really funny. Um, these were just really fun to design. I, I think it was just fun to do, so that's why I did that. Here's another fashion design. Um, they look very tall. <laughs> Here's another one of those, like, um, catalog order things. Um, I'm not sure what this is. <laughs> um, I did a lot of kawaii fruit drawings when I was younger, so here's some little, like, fruits. And I think that's the chicken from Moana. I think this is supposed to be in OC Story. But that was before I knew what OCs were. I think this is a really cute character, but she looks too similar to another character. Um, this is Moana. And here's some more of those stamps. I did the back of this stamp. So I, like, I made another design. Um, this is just... project I did in like 6th grade. That's just the way it looks. I really like the way that one is. It was supposed to be a self-portrait. I'm not sure if it really looks like me though. Um, this is some little like chibi fish. I did this at the end of 4th grade. I remember drawing this. Like, we are supposed to be watching some movies that I was drawing. Um, apparently that's just the Ariana Grande. I did this tutorial like three times before I kind of figured out how to do it. It was supposed to be like a manga style, so it was really hard for me to draw. Um, also I'm wearing this like watch. It doesn't even work, but <laughs> I think it's fun. Um, this is like a Christmas character. And then I think I was drawing some squirrels. I did do a lot of drawings of squirrels in this, um, 
book. I don't know why. But yeah. Uh, this is stuff from 7th grade, I believe. It's, yeah, I still have that shirt. Same thing with that one. I've tried to turn these jeans into a pair of shorts and that failed. <laughs> some mermaid designs. I actually like the way that one looks. It's very cool. That's very cute, actually. So here's some more stuff for that catalog. I think these are just plans. I don't know where the actual thing is. If I knew where it was, I would definitely show you guys it, but I don't know where it went because I did have a full, like, finished version of it. Okay, here's some more of those. And I think this is supposed to be a self-portrait. It does not look like me at all, though. A lot of these drawings have, like, tears or, like, folds in them because most of them were hung on my wall at one point. I don't do that anymore just because I think it looks messy. <laughs> Um, and yeah, some of them even have, like, tape on them. Um, I believe this is the only one that I kind of, like, made up from my head without using a tutorial. I just thought that, um, this would be kind of a cool design. Um, here's a squirrel. I used a tutorial for that one as well. I think this drawing is really cute. on like printer paper so it's very wrinkly. Um here's another drawing of Moana. I have that movie on my dresser actually like I have a whole collection of like CDs and DVDs that I have displayed and that is one of the ones I have. I think this is like one of the very few and only times I drew like manga or anime. Here's another um try at that Ariana Grande drawing. I, I don't, I don't draw her a lot. Um, and I don't really listen to her music. <laughs> um, this drawing I was really proud of for a while. I think these were like new markers, but, um, they're not the nicest. I think I still have them. I'm not 100% sure though. other project we had to do for sixth grade. I think this was like the beginning of sixth grade and we had to design this like truck or car that kind of like described our personality or something. So I did this like chibi one and that was when I was still into like squishies. I never really had those expensive squishies but I always wanted them even though they're very expensive for a piece of foam. Um, but yeah, I think this is really cute. <laughs> um, I really liked that word for a long time, so I would always draw, like, really stupid characters. That's really cute. Uh, here are some Shopkins I had. I think I traced some of these, like... I put the Shopkin on the paper and I traced it. <laughs> um, for whatever reason, I always thought this drawing looked like a school picture. <laughs> so this is some like gold pens type of thing, like metallic pens, and I drew some hairstyles. I don't know what that is. <laughs> but there's some drawings in the back. And here's cheerleader character. Um, anyways, this is that notebook, whatever, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this, if you do want to see another one of these videos, please give this a thumbs up, that way 
I know if you do want to see another one. Um, I do have a bunch of art, not just those two folders. I have a bunch of notebooks and stuff. So yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!